Sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, and stay tuned for this quick tech tip from Clarence Barnes and Lincoln Tech. You know, tribal knowledge says that running your diesel engine out of fuel means it's hard to get running again. It's not. Here's a few tips for replacing the fuel filter and priming the system yourself that should save you a few bucks. You see, most modern diesel fuel systems have a drain pedcock located near or on the fuel filter adapter. Just open that baby up and let it flow into a drain pan before removing the filter. The filter housing cap will thread off and is sealed with O-rings that should be replaced with new O-rings that come with your new filter. Coat the O-rings in diesel fuel to make sure they provide a good seal. Before installing a new filter into the housing, it's not a bad idea to evacuate fuel still inside the filter housing. It's most certainly contaminated and you don't want it cycling through your system. Next, reinstall the filter and cap and then it's time to prime the system. Now, some modern diesels have a plunger near the injection pump to prime the system. Others just require you to cycle the ignition key maybe about for 30 seconds. We don't recommend breaking the fittings loose on the injector rails to prime the system with the engine cranking over. That just makes a mess and is a potential fire hazard. Lincoln Tech can teach you how to have a career working with cars. See lincolntech.edu.